so today I'm checking out this Squire Standard Stratocaster HSS setup. It's a 2002 20th anniversary model, um, so you can't get this particular model new anymore. I think currently they're doing the Fat Strat Standard with a mirrored pit guard. I may be wrong, but yeah, this is a um, special edition. So, spec wise, it's a HSS, so you've got your humbuck on the bridge, two single coils on the middle and the neck. You've got a three ply pit guard, so you've got a metallic black finish. Uh, you've got your two point tremolo system uh, with your six saddles. I've got the whammy bar as well, but I'm not using that in this video. Five way selector switch, so you've got your in betweens, master volume, two tone controls, input socket. But yeah, it's not mint mint it's got a couple of little surface scratches but no dings you know chips or anything like that but it is 16 years old thing i like about these chinese models you can access the claw without taking the back cover off so they should do that on more models if you know if i'm honest but they don't so this has got the full thickness body like a mexican or american japanese strap You've got your 20th anniversary neck plate there. Um, onto the neck, 22 frets, 25.5 inch scale, so 25.5 inches from the nut to the bridge. Medium jumbo frets, 9.5 inch radius. It's got a really nice rosewood fingerboard. Um, the frets are immaculate. This guitar's hardly been played. Um, with some nice bird's eye. Markings on the back of the maple neck there. So you've got your large 70s headstock with a gold Squire logo. Modern style tuners. And you can see on the back, crafted in China, 2002. Yeah, really like the uh, finish of that neck. So it's like a smooth finish. Um, it was uh, um, just sort of an untreated finish to the back but it's got a bit of a sheen to it now where you know over time it's, it's again it's not been used a lot but yeah it's a really nice feel to it it's quite a chunky neck compared to the standards they make now um, it's got a C profile but yeah I quite like it um, that's about it really so I guess the next thing is to um, plug it in and see what it sounds like. Okay, so tuned it all up. And if anybody ever asks, you know, particular squires, do they hold tune well? Um, this guitar has been sitting in a gig bag for about four months. Um, it's been knocked about a few times, been moved around. And um, I pulled it out and it is literally banging tune. It hasn't moved an inch, so testament to the tuners there. But anyway, all right, I'm going to play a mixture of clean and distorted. I'm going to go through the five different positions. Um, so this is on the neck position, playing clean. Right, so in between the neck and the middle position. Thank you. 
And this is just the middle pickup on its own now. Okay, so this is in between the middle and the bridge position, so a bit of that humbucker kicking in now. Okay, so lastly, just that bridge humbucker all on its own. Okay, so we're going to play with a bit of overdrive now. So this is the mid pickup on its own. It's in between the neck and the middle position. between the middle and the
and the bridge position with a bit of that humbucker. <laughs> This is just the humbucker all on its own now. Squire standard Stratocaster 20th anniversary model, um, finished in a metallic black, 2002 Chinese made. Um, again, you can't buy this particular model new. They do the newer version with the mirror finish pick guard, which is about 250 pounds. Used, you can pick these up for about sort of 150, 200 quid. They do them in different colours, but yeah, really nice guitar, really well made, nice weight to them. Um, again, I'm loving the sound of the pickups. Let me know what you think to the sound in the comments below. Whether you prefer them, you know, clean, distorted, or if you like that humbucker, or just prefer the single calls. Let me know. So that's about it. But um, check me out on Instagram, Rob the Meat Manifesto. Um, I post most of my stuff on there. I may do a live stream tonight. Um, I'm not sure yet, but there should be one at the weekend as well. Um, also check me Patreon and Spreadshirt account where you can get some cool merch um, but yeah that's about it for now um, I'm gonna have a little play with this and uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you all soon